The highly coveted Player of the Year award goes to Alberta's Tyus Jefferson. The fifth-year guard led his Golden Bears to a perfect 16-0 record this season while showing up big on every inch of the court. You can't miss him on offense, smoothly slashing to the basket or controlling the ball movement in seamless plays. On the scoring balanced Golden Bears, Jefferson worked with extreme efficiency this season, scoring on more than half of his attempts as a guard. His basketball IQ is always on full display as he reads the action on both ends of the court. On the defensive side, Jefferson's agility and effort shine through. The Riverton, Utah product also makes those around him better, the key to the success of this powerhouse Golden Bear squad. The Defensive Player of the Year is Tyus Jefferson. No, that's not a mistake. Jefferson is the first ever player to win both the Player of the Year award and Defensive Player of the Year award, and he did it in the same season. Jefferson's prowess in the game shines through on the defensive side of the ball, where he averaged 2.1 steals and 4.4 rebounds on the season. His anticipation is second to none as he reads offenses, then uses his skill and speed to get himself into a prime position to stop them. Jefferson's intensity on this end is every coach's dream as he pokes balls free before his check even gets the chance to score. The head-on-a-swivel player beats the will out of opponents through his defensive excellence. The Rookie of the Year is Victoria's Elias Ralph. The first-year guard proved a versatile scorer and contributor with his 17-1 Vikes. Whether it's a dash and splash, spinning jumper, or step around, Ralph has all the tools to score against strong defenders and to put on a show while doing it. Ralph can create his own opportunities, bringing a spark to his team when needed. He boasts mature control for a rookie and displays a fearless, free and confident style of play night in and night out. The Okotoks Alberta product averaged 9.5 points and 4.3 rebounds over 19.4 minutes per game this season on a competitive team where playing time is never guaranteed. He will be one to watch in the years to come. The Student Athlete Community Service Award finds its home in Regina, where Benjamin Hillis shares his talents on the court, in the classroom, and within the community. The fifth-year guard has put up big numbers all over the court, ending the regular season averaging 13.6 points, 4.6 assists, and 5.3 rebounds. But he also posts impressive stats in the classroom. The actuarial science major is a five-time academic All-Canadian and Dean's List honoree. Despite this already busy schedule, he finds time to volunteer whenever his community needs him. He's helped raise money for the local burn unit fund, created videos to help kids stay active during the pandemic, visited schools to talk with students, and advocated for mental health while providing advice and resources. A true leader in every sense of the word, Hillis is also a member of the Student Athlete Leadership Council. It takes a special type of team to go without a single loss during a season. This year, that team was led by Barnaby Craddock, who instilled a winning mentality in his players. Craddock's Golden Bears play with a team-first approach, which has given them the success they've seen this season. That stems from the coach. From their defensive schematics and intensity to their offensive sharing of the ball, Alberta has cemented its reputation as an unshakable force. Craddock's work goes beyond day-to-day -day practices and games as his recruiting and leadership within the program has led them to where they find themselves today, the country's number two ranked team. This is the coach's fourth time earning this honor, his third as a Golden Bear.